Hello, my name is Sam. I'm from usephotoshop.com, a free tutorial, template, and photo resource. In this video, I'm going to help you understand the patch tool in Adobe Photoshop. I'm running the most current version at this time, Photoshop CS5. If you don't already have an image open, go to File, New to open a new file, or preferably go to File, Open to open an existing photo or file from your hard drive. Or you can use the keyboard shortcut, which is by holding down Control and pressing the letter O. I'm using this photo here. To find the tool, go to Window, Tools, whoops, to open up the Tools window or the Tools palette. It's fourth from the top on the left hand side and may be hiding behind the Spot Healing Brush tool, the Healing Brush tool, or the Red Eye tool. If it is, simply left click with your mouse and hold down, you will see this menu appear and you can select the third option, the patch tool. The keyboard shortcut for the patch tool is J, meaning if I'm using another tool and I want to use the patch tool, simply by hitting the letter J on my keyboard, I will be taken back to that tool. Let me show you how it works. I'll zoom in on this picture by holding down control on my keyboard and using the plus key. I can also zoom out by pressing minus. We're going to remove some of the darkness under her eye. We can use this by making sure the patch tool is selected. Also make sure your layer is selected by going to window and opening up the layers window or the layers palette. You can also use the keyboard shortcut which is F7. Select the layer you're working on and trace around the problem area by holding down with your mouse and tracing around. This is essentially the crop tool in Photoshop and we'll trace around the problem area and it will create a marquee around it. You will see it gives us a few options up here and uh, for now we'll leave this as the source. Uh, you will see when I click and drag this away um, the marquee will move with my cursor and I can select a clean area of skin. And when I let go it will apply it. I can also use this as the destination. The destination means that whatever is selected here will go to the destination, meaning I can move that over here, which looks very strange. Again, we'll leave this as the source. We'll drag this away to a clear piece of skin. It will apply that, and we can still make some changes by going to Edit, Fade Patch Selection, or on our keyboard, we can hold down Shift, Control, and the letter F. And this window will open up, and we can change the opacity of essentially the layer we just put over this area with the patch tool. And to keep some of the original texture, I find uh, normally about 60 or 70 percent um, works best. In this case, I'm going to go with uh, a little under 60 percent. And to deselect, go up to select and click deselect. Or on your keyboard, hold down control and press D. So there's the after, and we will undo to see the before. There's the before. That's the patch tool in Adobe Photoshop. I'm Sam from usephotoshop.com.